Oh, God. Why are we doing this still? I don't know. Why is this dog coughing so much today? <laughs> yeah, dog is here today. Cat somewhere, too. If you're real unfortunate, y'all will get some delicious audio of the dog dry coughing for no reason. God, it's disgusting when he does that. <laughs> he just sometimes gets excited and coughs. This is you know? where we left off. We have our new dog. Yeah, I hate it. <laughs> Everyone likes this dog. No, nobody likes that dog. Only you like that awful thing. Someone drew fan art of this dog and it's great. Yeah, and it's probably pornographic too. That's how <laughs> fan art works. I've seen fan art. I know how fan art works. <laughs> we stole your dog. <laughs> is that her dog? Oh no! That's a child! It's smaller than you! What are you doing? You're stealing a child's dog! Okay, canonically, I don't know where this is said, but it's apparently Lena's dog. That's the child's dog, and you <laughs> took it. That is a little girl, and you have introduced her to trauma. You know, she's wearing rainbows. I'm going to say she's an LGBTQ child, and this is homophobic. You taking her pink puppy. <laughs> this whole dog is a rainbow, okay? No. This whole dog is like three colors. <laughs> it's pink and purple and, and penurple. What? Oh, okay. <laughs> Is it too late to name the dog Penurtis? Absolutely. <laughs> Damn it. Lord. Why are you like this? There's that girl. She's just like standing there watching you steal her dog. I mean, what's going to happen next is even worse. Oh, no. What are you going to do? I'm going to get in a fight with an old man. <laughs> That's an old man. You're a terrible person. We are not the terrible person here. Who's the terrible person here? The old man is. What did he do? Give it time. Mm. Functionally, old man radius is a tutorial, but wow, even the dog abandons us. Good. It no. looks like apparently I don't understand the value of friendship. No, good luck. <laughs> you suck. <laughs> Here's an old man. He's teaching us about the battle. Wow, that's a good laugh. <laughs> We're going to skip all of this tutorial. You'll figure it out. It's not hard, but it's worth it just for watching what the old man does to us. Ba Good. <laughs> <laughs> you deserve it. I just gave you two minutes of your life back, so you didn't have to watch an old man give us a tutorial. I like that when they made his little 3D model on Sarge, they capped off the bottom of his shorts so that nobody can see his little panties up them. It's very modest. What? What? <laughs> what? Old man, I'm gonna remember this, and I'm gonna get strong, and I'm gonna put on my helmet that I forgot to put on. <laughs> wow, that's why he knocked you out. It was just to shame you for keeping equipment in your inventory. God, I wish I had a purple helmet instead. Mm -hmm. I bet, I bet if you had the helmet on, I bet he wouldn't have one shot you like that. Oh no, he would have totally one shot it. Nope, nope, mm -mm, nope. You would have won the fight and yeah. gotten really cool loot. Now you'll never get it. You can allocate your elements. Whatever. All right, you'll, you'll pick it up. It's not a hard battle system. No. It was not a, a remarkably difficult game, other than trying to get literally everybody into your party at all times. As I recall. I mean, yeah, you just want everybody in your party, and none of them really matter. The one thing this game does really good, it's got a great color palette. It's it colorful as fuck. It is, and it's got a lot of treasure chests, and we like those. Yeah, these dudes are just hanging out. I'm not going to fuck with these guys. Ooh, a bone. <laughs> That's a coffin. <laughs> yes? That's a coffin. You found a box of bones. You raided a coffin and took the skelly bones out. I actually love this part right here, just the mm -hmm. art design. Considering they're on a PS1. Mm-hmm. You're still a bad man. I mean, look at this great thing behind us. That is kind of bat batshit crazy. This was the PS1. Yeah, this is probably one of the good looking games on the PS1. Think about Cloud's block hands. Yeah, I was I was just thinking of... Serge and just, Lena. Yeah, he looked like a bunch of, you know, those those little tangram, the tiles that you use to make shapes? He looked like those that gained sentience and tried to fuck. <laughs> I've never heard that word in my life. You've never seen them? They're like little plastic things. They're like little geometric shapes. And then you try to solve like how to make them into the shape of a bird. It's for little children. I know what I'm doing on the airplane next time. Yeah, we're bringing you lots of little garbage blocks to play with. 
Like, the overworld's actually pretty beautiful. This is the point where people switched away from sprite art and into, like, awful jaggies. Mm-hmm. We are not supposed to be here. Sir. Yes, there's oh. a reason. <laughs> this man's job is to just shoo <laughs> the children away. And you specifically, like the elder must have gone just and wait. sent a bird or something. Yeah, we can't go in here yet. This is dwarf territory. But we got a dog with us. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Well, the elder didn't say anything about Sarge with an awful balloon dog. He didn't even... <laughs> Useless. <laughs> Useless. That guy's my buddy. <laughs> that guy's cool. <laughs> I like him. Pashoo Shoo is the sound of Pashoo licking himself to Ugh. give himself solace. <laughs> I hate it. That's what your dog does. I mean, that's our dog. Correct. Why is it that when he licks himself, he's my dog? Same as when the cat poops, <laughs> it's your cat. How dare you. Look, you can interact with a rock. Great job. Wonderful. That oyster's gonna be pissed. I mean, it likes being wet. It didn't like being out on the dry. You did it a favor. We didn't kill its buddies over on the Cape Howl, but this thing was in the way of a box. Yes, and boxes one must get. Yeah. Some benevolent force has put these boxes there. Ooh, some benevolent force abandoned these creatures. And also made this dog. Ugh. Yeah. Isn't the dog... I mean, are we avoiding spoilers? No. Okay. Spoilers are okay. This game can drink... Well, That's true. The game is very old. People who are concerned about the finer points of the plot really, really... Sh Isn't it a science dog? I don't think, remember. It's been like 21 years. I think, I think like very unpleasant science made this bad dog. And yes, I could look it up and no, I will not. We'll get there. We'll get there. Yeah. Yeah. Gross humor. It's vitreous humor than your eyeballs, right? Ugh. Ooh. I do like the use of pink in this game though. You know what I hate that's like vitreous humor? Huh? I hate when beauty products use serum. Serum is in your blisters. Yes. Serum is the part of your blood that's not red blood cells and not white blood cells. It carries stuff around and it's what your blister water is. And so there's <laughs> always like advertisements and it's like beautiful ladies with perfect skin and their long hair and they're like, the new is L'Oreal Serum. And I'm like, blah. I'm surprised I don't use chickpea liquid just for the name. <laughs> now with Aquafava. Aquafava. Awful. I gotta say one thing about the elements in that you can allocate elements to a higher level than what they are normally and it makes them a little more powerful, but nobody cares. Number goes up. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Number go high, fight not hard anyway. Yeah. It's fine. Aquafaba is chickpea water, but it sounds fancy. Ah. Oil of Olay now with Aquafaba. I mean... Aqua is water, and I think fava is just bean. I think it's really just bean water in another language. This coffee is just bean water. Uh, well, yeah, and delicious. Vanilla soy latte is just three bean soup. I mean, you're not wrong, but you shouldn't say it. <laughs> <laughs> is cereal a soup? No. I mean, you don't eat cereal like a normal person. Dry cereal is the right way. Gross. Yeah, I don't wet my bread. I'm sorry that that's disgusting. You wet your bed. No, I just eat the dry cereal. Do you pour Mountain Dew over your bowl of chips? I mean... No, because it's disgusting. You eat those separately. You got your crunchums and you got your drinkums, and there the two shall meet. They meet. Okay. Yeah, time makes fools of us all. <laughs> but by the time they meet, you've masticated the chips and they're not crunchums anymore. Ah, I'm I found the technicality. I talked my way out of that one. I skip a step because I'm so efficient. <laughs> oh no, you just swallow the shorts. I was going to edit out some of these fights and I'm like, you know what? It's COVID. What else are you doing? There's no sports. Watch this beat up a lizard. Yeah. <laughs> Lizard fights on the sweet, sweet internet. I don't like po po Shul's little BDSM collar. I well, don't like that at all. Oh, well, her final, like, technique. We haven't even gotten a technique. She takes it off. Of course she does. And then names a new master. And it's a major 
I don't, I don't like this. Oh, oh no. My, I, <laughs> Fifty Shades of Pink starring Pashul. I hate it. <laughs> <laughs> I want to go somewhere else mentally. The only thing worse than her level 7 technique is her level 5 technique, which is, it says something like, she's digging in her doggy dirt box for a surprise. I hate that because... Here's the thing. When you okay. started making that joke about it being worse than her taking off her collar, yeah. the first thing I wanted to say was she takes off her panties. And then <laughs> you said <laughs> digging in her doggy dirt box and it fixed nothing. Nothing's better. Everything's bad. So I have to jump on this lizard. I'm going to move... Put, get your dirty cat ass off my microphone. Yay! Ass right on the microphone. She Gross. jumped on the lizard. Gross. You did great, Scabs. You gotta jump on the lizard, but there's a fucking delay. And I'm just gonna impress on you how miserable this puzzle is. <laughs> this, this puzzle of hard to jump on lizard. No, actually, you're lucky. It turns out, I remember, I edited two minutes of me trying to jump on this lizard. Oh, no! I want, nobody wants to see me jump on this lizard and miss for two minutes you and two seconds. You are mistaken. <laughs> I would love to just sit here and watch your slowly <laughs> mounting frustration. I, who watched you play Wobbly Chocobo until <laughs> you beat it. <laughs> Amongst all people, I would most like to see the struggle of jump on lizard. I did sports. not like to jump on lizard. Well, I'm sorry. Perhaps other challenging puzzles lay ahead. These things don't really do much, though. You just beat on them. This is they're like... lizards. Be nice to them. They don't even have equipment. They have eggs. They're just trying to mind their own business and you're beating them up and somehow you're the hero. Yeah, they have nice scales. Mm -hmm. And then all that and you denigrate the poor lizard, what did nothing. I'm going to use only one piece of it, not even use all the parts. Yeah, not even multiple scales. These are covered in them. Just you one. Awful. Wait, just did it say scale or did it say scales? Scale. One. You just picked off one and then you fucked off. This the is like in the Warcraft one. quest when I'm like, I only want one of your two ears because I'm weird. Yeah, because you killed the other ear in battle. I go, you have four hooves, but I'll take one. Yeah, because you ruined the rest of them. Exactly. Terrible. Well, I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. This little booger runs through this hole every time you approach him. Yeah, entomb him. Yeah. You're gonna live in here. Take that, Jesus. <laughs> what? It's in the, the cave with the stone. <laughs> what do you mean, what? Just because you weren't raised in a Christian household. It's a sore <laughs> spot amongst my people. <laughs> Damn, I should have let Denaru LP this first. <laughs> I'm sure, one, Grace will not watch even an instant of this, and two, she will make that same joke. I love him. He doesn't even know who you are. It's fine. <laughs> it's for the best. <laughs> it can't be derivative if they don't know you exist or care. Exactly. <laughs> oh my god. It's more of an homage at this point. Ah. No, it's an allegory. I no. Yeah. What? Allegory is a special word for Bible metaphor callback. I know what an allegory is. It's my favorite literary device, and it's the only way that a sci-fi story is worth reading is if it's allegory. You never even read Hy uh, You never even read Hyperion, you fake-ass nerd girl. <laughs> I like damn apples. I like them very much. If you would like to read Hyperion, I have it. I feel like I have a digital copy of it that I stole from a digital library. It's very good, but it's more Decameron instead of the Bible. Or Canterbury Tales. That's fine. Except Things don't uh, need to specifically be the Bible. Like Frankenstein's an allegory and it's non-biblical. Frankenstein is the allegory for the story of the man and the children came down and said, go down, you bald head. And he went back in the woods and called Frankenstein's monster, which was a bear, and the bear <laughs> ate them. I mean, you're not wrong, but then you're supposed to empathize with the bear. <laughs> the bear ate too many children and got diarrhea. Oh, no. They're so <laughs> greasy. Yeah, now I understand how the bear felt. <laughs> So one of the things that I'll tell you... That's a booty hole. Yeah, we're going in the booty hole. <laughs> oh, no. 
They don't tell you you can go in the booty hole. You're supposed to figure out you can go in this random hole. I mean, immediately on seeing that thing, I went, that's a booty hole. So I don't know what you do when you see a booty hole in a video game, but I try to at least go yell down it. Maybe there's treasure. We are going to keep you away from the uh, adult version of Steam. Oh, no. Yeah, there's nothing good in there. <laughs> I forgot that when I was a kid, RPGs were just there to suck up time. Mm-hmm. You go, look, you're gonna fight things just to have th something to do, so we're gonna pad this game. Yep. They went, hey, we know that people complain if they complete a game in eight hours, so we're gonna give you eight hours of content and 20 hours of filler, and it's gonna be game of the year. Yeah, now people are like, I don't have 80 hours for an RPG. And then Persona's like, too fucking bad, you gotta learn how to be a high schooler again. <laughs> be a high schooler and grind it out. Yeah. Just grind it on out. Yeah. Go neglect your kids, neglect your job. Just here's 120 hours in an RPG, you're in high school. Solve your friends' problems. <laughs> Maybe fuck three of them. Oh no. That's what Persona is. And you're supposed to only fuck one of them and then you play through again. I don't have that kind of time. Well, that's what the internet and other Let's Plays are for. Fair. Pick, you know, Persona 5, I picked Smelly Wife and I stuck by her. <laughs> <laughs> she was the only stink in my heart. Do you want to explain who Smelly Wife is? No, anyone who's played that game knows instinctively who Smelly Wife is. They look at her and they go, mmm, that's a musty, musty little lady. <laughs> Fair. I mean, you, you go on a date and clean her room. It's issues. She's got issues. I'd rather have sex on the rats. <laughs> I think she was a minor. I would have... Ah, now it's uncomfortable. We're gonna say that everyone in there is of age and there's no relationship and balance of power. I mean, I do think they're all of approximately the same age. And that the relationships are equal. There we go. There we go. Not like Pushul here, who... I don't know if she's older or younger than you, but either way, I'm uncomfortable. She's spit out a whole bucket of puppies. Yuck! She's gonna have those long dog nipples. They just didn't have the pixels to render them. <laughs> Thank God. Oh, oh, the lock is just hiding her teeth. God, now, oh, no. now I just want to see, like, Art of Pashul, like no. a milk tank. No, you can't <laughs> say it. You're gonna will it into the universe. Mil she doesn't take long or skill to draw. Milk tank Pashul. Oh, no. Oh, no, real no, quick. No, I actually no, have to no. talk about a mechanic here. Uh, Chrono Cross artificially gates your stat gain behind boss fights, so you can't grind too much. Which actually fucking rules, but it means stick with the same party, otherwise you're fucked. You. Oh no, that means you're keeping this? No, you get new party. There's so many people that you're going to meet. You're gonna get everybody on the bus and you're gonna stick with the kink dog with long nipples? I do what I want. I hate what you want. I'm gonna get this little chicken. You're gonna uh, get it. You're gonna get it, young lady. That chicken's just trying to run away from you and your flapping nipples. <laughs> Yuck. Yeah, yeah, it's bad. It's a bad thing. Scabs knows it. She knows what bad is. What a bad cat. No, she's a good cat. Scabs. Number one at Kitty. That's the other thing. I think Chrono Cross has about 40 characters. That sounds right. And rather than write individualized dialogue, which they do for RPGs nowadays, they just went, we're going to add in a dialogue filter for each one. <laughs> Except for the Mama's here. Oh no. Mama's mad we cut all her babies. I mean, it's understandable. Yeah, I mean, you pass an egg that big and someone kills your baby, come tell me how it is. Did they really not have any actual different dialogue? I think I only played through the game the one time. I think that the vast majority of people, they just run through a dialogue filter. Huh. Yeah. What a shame, because it's kind of following up on Chrono Trigger, where it was really interesting when you got certain people in your party and you'd replay scenes because you'd get completely different dialogue options depending on who you took, like, up the mountain. Well, they had nine, we have 40. Well, <laughs> that's fair, but I still don't like it. He's gonna get on the bus. Yeah, they had more time and finances over at Squaresoft at the time. I mean... 
they probably had more at this point in time. Yeah. I mean, they were coming off a few different successes. This fight does not expect us to have Pashul yet, so it's just kind of a cakewalk. Mm. But it does mean I can't grind my way out of fights for the LP. What kind of... What? Get him. How did they not expect you to have Pashul? How would you... Okay. You don't need this dog. This oh. dog is here for flavor. Okay. This is a flavor hound. If Pashul were ice cream, she'd be rough reason. Oh. I'm really upset because I just noticed Pashul's HP is 69, and I wish she would gain a level. Never. <laughs> Wait, never mind. Yay! I win the day! <laughs> and you took just one scale off the mother. Yeah. Awful. I mean, at least they wrote dialogue for Pashul. Scales? Sure Nothing's gonna pronounce things like that. Aren't you glad I'm not one of those LP people who read the dialogue for everything? I hate it. Wait, <laughs> there's people who do that? Oh yeah, there's people who do LPs that just read the dialogue for every person. That's like, their LP. Like, like it's when somebody is reading a bedtime story to a kid so they have to do Donald Duck's voice? They don't even do voices, they just read it. Well, that's terrible. Yeah, I hate it. <laughs> That's the worst. How did you get through the lizards? She, I mean, you already jumped on them all. Yeah, this is her dog. Well, good. How come she says, how are you doing perfectly fine? <laughs> wow. Wow. I don't like that Lena is okay with, with the dog watching. <laughs> Well, yes, that, but also having a pet that clearly has human-like intellect. That's not right. You have Brooks. Yeah, but I don't collar him. <laughs> he wishes. <laughs> he wishes. <laughs> For sure, what are you doing in the sand? Uh, digging up a cat litter box. <laughs> yeah, there you go, make a duke. Yuck. And now burying it. I've seen cats, I know how this works. I don't like this. Well, I'm sorry, but that's just the way things are sometimes. I was going to retcon and say this world has no cats in it, but we know that's very wrong. Ah, all worlds need cats. The sea and war, they never change. Wow. The sea will be here long after you die, little girl. <laughs> I mean, not untrue, but that doesn't mean it's unchanging. It's constantly changing. Yeah, that's kind of the sea's thing. I mean, She's it's wrong. rising right now. She's wrong. Yeah, I'm gonna go talk to her. I'm gonna scold her. I like her fascinator. Also, doesn't... I feel like in Chrono Trigger, at one point, the planet just outright froze. Yeah, probably. Yeah, I, I remember. I feel like it... I mean, it was definitely desolate, but it was maybe frozen. I remember the day you pooped your pants at the beach and had to do a funny walk home and I promised never to tell anybody. Is that why he wears big shorts like that? It wasn't me. I promised her. <laughs> oh. Is that why she wears a dress like that? Correct. Nice. <laughs> Puts that into context. Yuck. Yeah, it just... did float away. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Yuck. <laughs> Pashul is, like, really invested in burying that turd. <laughs> She's busy in a cat trying to bury a turd on a marble floor. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you of what I've learned about adulthood, Lena. It's no one knows what the fuck they're doing. Yeah, imposter syndrome. No, no imposter. You just do your best. Well, I mean, it, if, if it were a real thing, it wouldn't be a syndrome. You'd just be an imposter. You still do your best. <laughs> exactly. Oh, Lena, gotta go. My mom's calling me. Dog is fine. Yeah, it's, is it though? You're just gonna pretend she found a crab and is playing with it. I mean, that would be great. Haha, uh -huh, you like Pashul now? No. Oh, I thought you meant Lena was just sitting down to play with the crab, not Pashul. Now I regret my positivity. Oh, a hard cut to full motion. Yeah. Look how many time and effort was put into this. I mean, it's not that ugly, though. They work no. hard. It's good water effects. Mm -hmm. Although it's not like they were rendered live in-game. No. 
kitty. They put lots of hairs on that kitty. That kitty had more hairs than you'd expect a little animated kitty of the period to have. And then this terrible looking water. Yeah. You drew all those hairs and then you made a wave look like this? Water's hard. I mean, it really notoriously is, but so is his hairs. We can't even figure out a good way to film fire yet. Fire hates being filmed. Yes, I like how much fire... Fire hates being photographed and the moon hates being photographed. And I appreciate that. The moon hates it when you look at her through a lens. Yeah, she goes, fuck you, I'm just a circle. (laughs) You look at her in real life, you're like, ooh, so subtle, so beautiful, so much going on. This shape, these valleys and mountains, and then you take a photo and it just looks oh, like Oh no, shit. an old man found us on the beach. Uh oh, he's gonna be brushing your hair like one creepy cowboy. <laughs> Yuck. Look who brought his pet lizard to wake us up. No, he's come back to shame you. That lizard tattled on you. I was gonna say, it's like when you taught the dog to jump on my balls in the morning. <laughs> you know who we are, old man. I chased this lizard earlier. You yelled at me. <laughs> yeah, rightly so. And then you went and killed all its siblings. For what? Three scales? Correct. Awful. Wow, our friend ditched us at the beach. Yeah, she was like, you know what? This guy kind of sucks. Also, why has he only got the three scales? Yeah. Fine, we'll go see our friend. Why did she leave us, though? That's kind of messed up. I mean, you deserve it. And Grandpa doesn't remember us cocky chicken bird yes because it has a bodyguard oh, oh look no. this thing's this, still here i'm so glad this horrible thing remembers you your <laughs> friend doesn't know who you are and is completely missing but thank god you got this woke up first <laughs> no th- what is that what oh sign i thought they just took the word now like, say this thing. one say this one combusted awful i hate it <laughs> I hate that thing. Somebody wrote this. Somebody worked really hard and wrote the dialogue and specifically made sure that horrible creature had lots of S's in it. (laughs) This game fucking rules. No! (laughs) 